Today we are looking at Milwaukee's M18 job site radio with charger. This thing retails for about $220. It's been out for a pretty long time. I don't have one. I uh, My friend loaned this one to me because he's like, hey man, you haven't done a review on that job site radio. I'm like, yeah, because I don't have one. I have all the other job site radios, but not this one. And this is the one I actually wish I had because this radio is an all around great radio. Some of the features that it has, the other radios don't have, just even the new packout radio they don't they don't have. So this retail, it's like I said, for $220. When it first came out, it was like almost $300. And that was one of the reasons why I did not get it at the time. But time going on, this has uh, gone down in price. So I'll put links in the description below on where you can get this and try to find the best price for you on it. So some of the features that this has on it, it is Bluetooth compatible. It'll, it'll go up to Bluetooth uh, for about, a, I think around 100 feet. So it connects really well to this. I didn't even uh, have this set up on my phone and it connected pretty much, as soon as I turned on the Bluetooth to my phone, it instantly connected to the phone. This is the number one feature that any of the Milwaukee radios has to have. And that is the bottle opener. Yeah, that's right. There it is right there. You got to have that bottle opener because we have to have our beverages. This has a little storage area where you can put your phone and it fits pretty well in there except for your iPhones. It doesn't fit your iPhone in there. You can't shut it. You can't even put it in there, but it is a nice little storage compartment. It has a weather seal gasket. You could put if you have an Android, you might be able to get your Android in it. And it gives you a uh, 16 inch, 3.5 millimeter jack that you can plug in an audio device, especially if you have the new phones, you don't have that uh, feature with the new iPhones. You just have to find a uh, direct connect Bluetooth. It has a USB charger in it that can charge your phone. I think it's a 2.0 or 2.4 charger. Now on the back, this has a nice little charger. And I, I really like that this has a cover that goes over the charger. So if you're not using it, it keeps the charger clean and uh, dust and or whatnot out of the elements of the weather, uh, won't get into it. And what's really cool is that it will accept all the way up to a M18 12.0 battery. It'll take any of the M18 uh, batteries that you have. This fits comfortably on it with a 12.0. Now runtime with this, uh, four to 5.0 battery, I think will give you a, a little over uh, eight hours. This radio has a 40 built-in 40 watt amplifier, which really packs a punch. I think it's just as loud or even louder than the pack out radio itself. The bass, if you're looking for something that ha you want some bass to it, this is this is hands down the radio that you want to get that is Milwaukee because this is this has that thump that ever, that's the people who wants want the bass. You got your antenna radio. This is nice because it has a cord wrap uh, so you can easily stow the power cord when you're not using it. You just don't have it dangling around. That's uh, a good thing that I like. It's just the Milwaukee Packout has that. The M12 radio doesn't have that. You just have your little power uh, supply and you have to deal on where you're gonna put that thing. So cord wraps, really nice to have. You have your Bluetooth button so you can connect your Bluetooth. Like I said, it connects really easily and really fast. Uh, when, once you press this button, it'll send the signal out, go into your Bluetooth. Uh, options, settings on your phone, and uh, just hit that button when it says uh, Milwaukee job site, uh, M18 charger and radio. And you have your different modes on here. You can, you have uh, AM, FM, you'll have your Bluetooth mode, and then you have your auxiliary mode too that uh, you can switch out on. It has your presets on this, and you got your play, you can, uh, play and pause off of here and you got your arrow, uh, right and left arrow to where you can skip around so you don't have to do it off your phone. You can just walk over and uh, hit the buttons, go to the next uh, song. Uh, you have your clock button 
uh, hold, press that down and you can uh, adjust your clock. You get two AA batteries with this and in the top on the side here, uh, you put those batteries in and it will keep your uh, clock running for uh, when you don't have a battery in and whatnot. And it'll keep all your presets to where you want. You can do, you have a preset button to where you can keep 10 different presets on the radio to your liking. The EQ is nice because you can customize your uh, your specifications because everybody you know likes to customize the EQ, get more bass, treble uh, out of that, you know. And then you have your power button with your volume button. It, to turn the unit on, you will, uh, let's turn it on right now. You will hold down the button for about two seconds. It'll light up, it'll, it'll uh, shine red, and that will tell you that the unit is on. And then you can, uh, adjust the volume like this. Now, when you have this connected to your Bluetooth, make sure that the volume is all the way up on your phone before you adjust the volume on here, because you may have this cranked, the volume cranked up on the radio, but hardly anything is coming out. And that is because your volume on your phone is not turned up all the way. So make sure our volume is turned up all the way on our phone. And let's test out the audio because that's what people want to hear. So I have this set right now to about half, halfway on the audio and uh, let's pick it up. Hopefully I don't upset anybody about the music, but I don't care. This is just a test. So we're going to check it out. Now this is right out of the unit now. It may sound a little different from the mic, but here we go. This has a little bass to it. That's what I wanted so people can check it out. Let's turn it up. That's all the way up. That's not bad, That's it, the whole unit is vibrating and uh, some people love that bass and some people don't. But just uh, if you have it for parties or whatnot, uh, this uh, is gonna get the job done. You can have it around the pool, Any anything It is uh, weather protected. This has a nice little cage around the whole unit. It's a plastic cage. Uh, it can take a beating. You can throw this in the back of your work truck and you don't have to worry about damaging it too much. After using this for a little bit and uh, testing this out, I'm probably definitely gonna get one uh, to keep it uh, for around the pool area because I really like the sound that comes out of this. I wanna thank uh, my friend for letting me uh, use this and uh, demoing this. So thanks for that. That's pretty much gonna sum it up for this uh, review and test on the Milwaukee job site radio with charger. Uh, if you like this video, hit the like button, uh, subscribe. If you are not subscribed, then do so. I am Philip Bridges, and I will see you in the next one.